Hello friends, my name is Michael with Dark Soul Radio, and today we'll be reviewing the latest album by Vandal Moon called Queen of the Night. If you aren't yet familiar with them, Vandal Moon is a modern darkwave act out of Santa Cruz, California. The group is comprised of Blake Voss on vocals, synths, and guitars, and Jeremy Einsettler on synths and drum machine. Queen of the Night is their third album for their label Starfield Music, and was released on August of 2022, following their previous two albums. 2018's Wild Insane, and 2020's Black Kiss. Overall, Queen of the Night is a fantastic record, really showcasing Vandal Moon's strong songwriting and storytelling skills. The album's theme is one of youth finding their way in a world which seems to be falling apart, and is told from the perspective of the main character, the Queen of the Night. The opening track, Young, Deadly, Beautiful, serves as a great introduction to the band's sound and the story. It's a nice, synth-heavy, slow-burning song, which introduces the main character and sets up the idea that the main character is confused at who they are currently, but is also brimming with potential. The title track, Queen of the Night, is the highlight of the album and easily my favorite. It's well-written and supremely danceable, and I found myself humming the chorus for days after the first time I heard it. Sweet Disaster is another track that's sure to be a favorite on the dance floor. I love the drums on this one, as they really give it a stompy feel which fit nicely with the atmospheric pads and the dreamy vocal. Chemical Love is a more introspective song, a warm, slow ballad about the character's need to escape the chaos of the world. It has a bittersweet feel, with bright guitars and a feeling of longing. Easy to Dream is a wonderful mix of warm synths and bright pads over a mid-tempo beat, featuring vocals from guest vocalist Lena Volney from Belarus, another modern dark alternative synth artist who I really enjoy. Too High to Cry is another favorite of mine, featuring drums which sound like classic 80s freestyle mixed with modern dark wave synth lines. This one features guest vocals from Johnny Dynamite of Johnny Dynamite and the Bloodsuckers, a New York synth artist. War is an interesting song, starting with kick drums over a sinister sounding synth before it transitions into a celestial chorus. It's truly beautiful. I felt the kick drums alone without the snare gave it a floaty feeling, which was truly enjoyable. Diamonds and Pearls is another slow ballad featuring guest vocals from Vanjie Lee, and wonderful use of piano and saxophone, giving this song a warm and luxurious feeling. Queen of the Night is Vandal Moon's strongest release to date, and we're sure to be hearing tracks on dance floors and dark alternative radio stations for quite some time. Queen of the Night is available now on Vandal Moon's Bandcamp page. The digital album is $10. For a limited time, a red lipstick cassette version and a crimson red vinyl version are available as well. I'll put links to their Bandcamp in the description so you can purchase the album. If you enjoy dark alternative music, be sure to like this video and subscribe to Dark Soul Radio. We feature mixes of dark alternative music each week, as well as live Twitch shows. Thank you so much for watching and supporting the dark music scene. It means a lot to me. Until next time.